morning. It's Friday and I'm at Gilpat to uh, we are all ready and set to head off on our first game drive. So plan is we'll be heading to the park office in the big three now in vehicle and switching to the safari jeeps uh, who are already lined up to get the park tickets. I hope that we can get in first or be one of the first to get in the park and uh, looking forward to this game drive. I was really anxious in the uh, night. I didn't sleep really well, uh, mainly because I was excited for the upcoming game drive. So let's see what we can find and uh, wish us luck and uh, stay tuned. I'm at the Wilpertha Park gate. Uh, we're waiting to buy our tickets and uh, we are the sixth in the in the line. Uh, there's only seven vehicles here, so uh, that's a good sign. There's less, it's going to be less crowded in the morning. Um, and uh, the weather's been good. There's been uh, there were a few showers yesterday morning, uh, but today morning uh, there seem, it seems to be quite dry and uh, looks quite promising. So looking forward to a great safari. Um, let's see what we can find. Uh, okay, so uh, we are just done with our morning game drive. Uh, fortunately, we didn't get any leopard sightings, but uh, it was pretty uh, nice to be back here in Vilpato. Uh, it's such a pleasant park. There's you know, a lot of greenery and uh, there's, there's been a lot of rain. So it's quite lush and green. Um, we are hoping to see, uh, we are hoping to head back out right now for lunch and uh, come back in uh, in the late afternoon. Uh, on route to the exit, uh, we came across um, a young sloth bear. Uh, we could not get any good footage because uh, uh, it was <coughs> hidden within uh, a dead foliage. Uh, but it was very interesting to just observe its behavior, uh, especially as it was digging for uh, for termites, and uh, it was blowing into the termite mounds and digging really fast. And it's quite interesting, interesting to observe that. Um, so we are on our way out. Uh, I'm with Bobby. Uh, see, so, and uh, we are looking forward to a full evening round as well. So stay tuned. Hi guys, um, we are in our uh, evening round of our first day of safari in Vilpatu. Um, has been quite an un uneventful day today. Um, haven't seen anything in the evening safari. Uh, nothing special to note and uh, from the word we get from all the, sa the safari jeeps, there's been no leopard sightings yet. Uh, there's only a few, about an hour left. So let's see how it goes. Mm -hmm. Morning everyone, uh, this is uh, our second day in Virpatu, uh, it's about 4 o'clock in the morning and uh, got up early getting to get ready uh, for our game drive, today we are going to do a full day game drive and uh, got our, you know, having our coffee and um, you know preparing for the full day. Uh, yesterday was not as eventful as we expected, but uh, we did see uh, one leopard uh, just as we were exiting the park. Um, it was on a tree, but we did not have enough time even to take a proper photograph because we need to get out of the park at 6 p.m. sharp. We also got a good... Uh, good view of uh, a rock Indian rock python um, at Kubukwila uh, in the water you could see only the head of the python <clears throat> then uh, we saw um, Indian sp uh, spectacle cobra um, close to Percy when they were uh, in the afternoon as well it was quite interesting to see it with a full hood up and uh, you know in the in a nice pose uh, 
um, let's see what we can find today because you are doing a full day we need to maximize on uh, um, our safari so let's see uh, if we can spend more time more attention and get some great sighting so um, yeah, more to get ready uh, wish us luck let's see uh, what today unfolds <laughs> Bye, bye, yeah. Hi, guys. Uh, it's midday at the moment in Vilpattu and um, we had an amazing sighting today uh, we found the Kurtupandi female leopard who kept walking along the road um, on Velikandha uh, road leading towards uh, uh, Mahapathasa and we just kept reversing back and we had an amazing uh, encounter and she was very calm and she just waited while we reversed back uh, if we if she walked all the way up to the jeep and uh, then uh, also then she cut across into the forest and we found her again uh, uh, at the kurutupandi at the road leading to kurutupandi uh, from kudapathasa and uh, we kept reversing back once again and then she suddenly went in into the forest and uh, we heard a loud noise and saw her running through the forest and uh, heard the call, alarm call of uh, Uh, giant rock squirrel uh, so I assume that it was chasing she was chasing uh, the squirrel there was a assumption that she was pregnant but uh, uh, not pregnant actually that she has given birth to cubs but uh, uh, we, it's hard to tell uh, looking at her appearance but it was really nice to just see her very calmly walking through the uh, along the road and paying no heed to our vehicle so we have just stopped in um, a remote area for lunch. Uh, we are having a while. We are staying in the vehicle and hope to continue our safari till evening. So stay tuned.
that wraps up all our sightings for this amazing adventure. Happy New Year to everyone and stay tuned for more wildlife adventures coming up.